Hey guys, today's video is going to be best beauty products of 2016. These are going to be some of the products that I have been enjoying. I would like to mention that if you are subscribed to me or you want to subscribe to me, welcome to my channel. Hi, um, I would like to say that YouTube doesn't notify you automatically once you subscribe to my channel. There's a new thing now, like when you subscribe to my channel or want to subscribe to my channel there will be like a little bell on the side next to the subscribe button make sure to click the bell that will notify you new videos of me like i upload new videos every tuesday and friday so if you want to see more of me make sure to subscribe to my channel before you leave and click the bell button to see new videos every Tuesday and Friday so if you want to see what are my products for 2016 then please keep watching I'm going to start with primers the two primers that I have been loving for 2016 is the NYX Born to Go Illuminating Primer and Maybelline Master Prime Face Studio. These are the two products that I have been enjoying for the month of 2016. I just really love this. This one is very affordable. These are two very affordable um, face primers that I really love. Really love. Like these are like very not that greasy and is great so um if you don't know if you're new to my channel I have oily skin so these are the products that works well for oily skin and it's not too shiny on your face it works well and just really love it so much so um I haven't found any like high-end like foundation primers that I really love most of them that I tried, they're okay. They're not that great. But if you like know any like good primers that is great for oily skin, just please leave a comment below and I will definitely try it out and do like a first impression video on it. So these are the two. One, this is NYX Born to Glow Illuminating Primer and this is Maybelline Master Prime Face Studio. I have four foundations that I really love from the drugstore. I haven't found any high-end products that are like great for oily skin. I haven't like purchased any from Sephora, from anything from NARS. I haven't even purchased any. But the ones that I really love from the drugstore and I've been crazy. I've been using this constantly. Is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless Normal to Oily 230 Natural Buff. If you are new to my channel and you don't know, well, I've been using this several, like a lot of times in my videos. My videos, and I just love it. It is very light, lightweight, it's not too thick, and that's what I really love, and it matches my skin skin tone perfectly and just really love like usually like certain foundations like um you have to like mix two foundations to get your perfect skin tone color this was perfect this matched my skin tone really great and just really love it it blends well i have no problem blending this so that's why i love maybelline fit me foundation the next foundation that I love from the drugstore is L'Oreal Paris 24 Hour Inflammer Pro Matte. So this is a foundation. The shade I got is 104 Golden Beige. The reason why I like this foundation is because that is really matte and it really lasts all day long. It really this they were definitely telling the truth it really lasts 24 hours like i had used this in the morning and in the nighttime come back home and it lasts all day long so i just really love it and the formula this is smooth and i just really like it it has like a 
like a dewy finish and i just really love this so much like i haven't tried like there's a new l'oreal i haven't tried the glow one and i haven't tried the new one the total full coverage one i haven't tried because i have been searching around for the full coverage one so if you guys know where is the new l'oreal foundation the total cover one please let me know comment below i've been searching everywhere for i've been going to ride it walgreens target and i don't see it so if you guys know where i could get it please let me know in the comment below so the next foundation that i have been loving from the drugstore is elf bb cream broad spectrum spf 20 this foundation i just really love especially like if you have like uneven skin tone this is perfect it has a bb cream spf 20 sunscreen so if you have like uneven skin tone and like you have like dark spots on your face and you're looking for a foundation that will like even out your skin this is great option i pay like six dollars for this i have been using this a lot this i've been using for an everyday use i just really love it like i don't use like expensive makeup for every day because i know it will go down 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 and it will like throw my money away so i just really love this it is very affordable it only costs six dollars and i just really love it this is every day oh my god I just use this for every day if i'm going like food shopping with shopping go to the movies i will definitely use this product next foundation from the drugstore that i really love and it's final is the cover girl clean oil control anti luscious 540 natural beige i really love this foundation so much because like since i have oily skin like certain foundation that i try especially the high-end makeup some of them are like very like greasy at least my face very shiny and that's not from my skin type so i just really love this cover girl oil control it really like control like the oils on my face i have did um a review a first impression off of this um foundation it will be up here or up here the video if you haven't seen it please check it out i did like a full video on this first impression review and demo and i, I share my thoughts and opinions about this foundation and i just really love it it gives a great dewy finish on your face and like i said it really like sucks up all the oil on your face and it really controls it well so if you are like looking for like a foundation for oily skin and you have like really really shiny face and you just want the oil to absorb please get this clean cover girl oil control 540 natural buff they come in all shades so just really love it and plus it's very affordable okay so now for concealers so I have three concealers that I have been loving and I have been like using it, using, using it for the year of 2016. So the ones that I came across and that I really, really love is the NYX Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer. This concealer, it, I just really love it. It is great this is um the shade of this is porcelain i've been using this a lot lately i just really love it so much like it really like if you like suffer from like dark circles this really like covers it well and really has a full coverage to it and that's why i really love it so much and i also use this so like as a a primer a eye primer so i just really love this and it's very affordable like it only costs like five dollars not bad right it's not affordable so i just really love it and 
the formula in this is okay it's perfect it doesn't like smear or nothing it is great and i truly love it this product i would definitely like repurchase purchase purchase i just really love it so the next concealer that i really love and i just can't stop using it those of you who are subscribed to me and you know which one i'm talking about i just love it i can't stop using it i've been using it constantly in my videos and it's the remnant london match perfection 230 fair light concealer so this is how the concealer looks like I have been raving about this for the longest. I am loving this. The like the reason why I love this is because of the built-in brush. Like using the built-in brush is great because you don't have to use like a concealer brush for this. And that's why I just really love it. And I love like concealers that have like a squeezy tube in it and it really like applies well under your eyes. Concealer, like you know, I just really love this so much and it's very convenient. I just really love this very convenient and i love it so much and what i do like i use this brush and i apply it on my eye then i use my beauty blender and i just blend it out so that is why i just really love this and they come in all shades too and it's also a very affordable and I just can't stop using this. I have like about 10 of these to be honest with you. Like I'm really like obsessed with this. Okay, enough for that. So the last concealer that I have been loving is the Physicians Formula Twin Concealer. This is the Twin Concealer from Physicians Formula. Um, this part I just really love. I use this a lot, like to cover up my dark circles. I just really love this end of the concealer. So the other side is a green concealer. I use this like to cover under my eye too. Like if I'm like contouring, I like to use this under my eyes. It's great. Like um, I know some people like they prefer using an orange concealer but it's only for certain people like i can't use orange concealer i'll look like a carrot to be honest with you so um a green concealer works well for me because the under eye of under my eyes is green so that is why i use green seal like many people like didn't understand why i use green seal i have did um how i contour my face with drug surplus like months and months ago if you haven't seen it it will be right here so um that is why i use green concealers because um it's match my under eye the veins on my eye is green so that's why i don't use orange like i know you're supposed to use orange to cover your dark circles but i just use the green one because it matched perfectly for me my skin tone like everybody has different skin tones so that is why i don't use the orange side so this is great um i bought this like at ulta beauty these found this um my foundation what am i talking about i'm talking about concealer this twin concealer goes a lot on sale at ulta beauty physicians formula is the best and it's very this is very convenient especially when you're like traveling around and you don't want to carry like um like a concealer like you know like a big tube of concealer and whatnot this is great and it's really love it it's twin and it's very convenient to like travel next thing i have is setting powders i have been loving the setting powders for like a couple of months i have received this in my boxy charm like months ago and i can't stop using this it is ofra pressed powder oil control so this is what i've been loving this formula is so great oh my god the formula is so smooth and i just really love it this is a high end part to be honest with you it costs 
forty dollars. I'm glad I didn't purchase this, but I'm gonna have to purchase it for forty dollars for my own too. Because like once this goes up, mm -mm -mm, I definitely have to buy myself another one for this. So I just really love it. I just really like it. It really like control the oils under my eyes, and I really like this to set my concealer in. And I just love it. I use this every day every day i use this on special occasions and every day like going shopping going to movies um looking around at the stores going to mall yeah i just use it every day i just really love this powder so much i just really love it and it's great it really like control the oils on your face and it's great for oily skin Okay, so the primer that I have, the eyelid primer that I have been loving for 2016 is Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, a long lasting eyeshadow base. So this is the primer that I have been loving for my eyes. Like a little goes a long way. And when I first tried this out, I squeezed out a lot and that was way too much. And I waste a lot of product in this tube. Now I learn and so I know like only like to squeeze like a small dot and then apply it all over your eyelids and it's great it's fantastic this is fantastic if you are looking for an eyeshadow primer if you don't know which one to get this one is urban decay and just really love it so much that's why i just love it i've been using this for months and months on my videos um that's why i just really love it i don't know if i'm gonna like continue using this or like I'm really for this year of 2017 I want to try new stuff so I want to try new eyeshadow primers new everything new foundation new concealer new everything the next products that I have been loving for the year of 2016 um, are these two eyeshadow palettes I've been loving. The first one I've been loving for the year of 2016 is Maybelline Graffiti Nudes. I just love this so much. This is Maybelline Graffiti Nudes. I love it so much. It has beautiful colors and it's very pigmented and i just really love this and it's very affordable you can find this everywhere or all, all your drug stores they have them and it's very affordable and it has like colors for every occasion they have like they have neutral colors bright colors when you're gonna go like very dramatic so i just really love this so much and it's very affordable. It's very pigmented too. Like certain like drugstore eyeshadows, they're not very pigmented. And I always constantly have to use like a setting spray to make it like very like matte. So that is why I just really love this one. Okay, the next one, it is a high-end eyeshadow palette that I have been loving for the year of 2016 is... The Kat Von D Monarch eyeshadow palette. So these colors are so beautiful. Look at this. This is the Monarch and look at this. Look how gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I just really love Kat Von D. Oh my gosh. She makes some crazy like all her eyeshadow palettes or like very like unique like I never seen it before Kat Von I just really love her so much I love Kat Von D I haven't tried their like other products foundation okay back to this I'm going way overboard so yeah I love this um Kat Von D Monarch butterfly palette like I said these colors are so beautiful and it's very pigmented I have no problem applying this I definitely don't need like a setting spray for this because these are very pigmented by itself and just really love it so if you guys never tried this 
palette before by Kat Von D, the Monarch one. Please get it. It is great. And these colors are great for now. For like, it was great for the fall and it's great for the winter now. It's very like wintery. Like, it's very, it has like warm, neutral colors to it. And just really like it. And it's great for an everyday use. Next, I have mascaras. I have three mascaras that I have been loving for the year of 2016. Okay, the first mascara that I have been loving is the Revlon Super Length Mascara. So this mascara I have been loving so much. It really like lengthens out your lashes and just really love it and also give like volume to your eyes too and just really love it so much and this is how the brush head looks like and that is why I just really love it. It really like volumes and it's great. The next mascara that I have been loving is the L'Oreal Volumes Butterfly Waterproof Mascara. Um, I just really love this so much. It's like it's very it has a blue one they come in black too but i like the waterproof one because it lasts all day long the other one is good like they have like the regular l'oreal balmas it's like instead of it like being blue it's black like i don't use that one because like it doesn't the black one doesn't last all long but if you do get like the waterproof one it lasts all day long so that's why i use the waterproof one if you guys are wondering why i have waterproof and not the regular one so that is why i just really love this it gives a great amount of volume and what i really love the most about this mascara is that the brush look at this brush. this brush like when you apply it it goes like it goes like up when you apply it up it has like a up motion so when you apply this on your eyelashes is it curls your eyes up and I just really love it so much that so this is the brush what I'm talking about see the end of this the end of this you curl your lashes up and that's why I just really love it and this is great I just really like this so the next mascara and final for the mascara is Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara I love this mascara so much because also it gives like a great amount of volume like if you don't want to wear falsies this will like make your eyelashes like very like pop up like it gives like a great volume to your eyes um and that's why I just really love it. It has like a decent brush size. It's great. Next for eyeliners, I have three eyeliners that I've been loving. There's two drugstore and one high-end product. So started from the drugstore, the two drugstores that I really love and I've been talking a lot for the year of 2016 is the Wet n Wild Color Con Eyeliner. This eyeliner is great. They come in all colors. They come in. This one is a brown color. This is a brown color. And it comes in black, purple, all different colors. And just really love it. And it's very affordable. I think I pay like only like 99 cents. And they go on sale a lot of variety. There's a lot of like sales on this on variety. Sometimes where in one part of variety are 40% number. And that's why I just really love it. So the next drugstore eyeliner that I've been loving, I've been using it constantly, is the Milani Retractable Eyeliner. So this is the Milani. It comes like in a uh, like a crayon eyeliner and it's retractable. So this is it. This is a shade of this is black. So this is retractable and it has like a twisty thing you go up and down to see how many products you want to apply to this eyeliner. I just really love this eyeliner so much. It's very affordable. I love Milani eyeliners. I haven't tried their lipsticks and other products from them. But I'm willing to try them out if you have any suggestions. If you know any like good Milani products you want me to try. I will definitely try it and I'll do like a 
first impression video on it. So, this is it. I'm just really love it. Okay, so for the high end eyeliner that I really love, I've been using it constantly, is the Dolce Cosmetic Ultra Precision Eyeliner. The shade of this is black and it's made in Germany. I've received this in my Ipsy bag and I just really love it so much. This is great eyeliner and it lasts all day long. When I say it lasts all day long, it lasts all day long. I have to use like several things to take it off when I'm taking off my makeup. That's how strong this, the formula of this eyeliner is. So this is Dolce Cosmetics Eyeliner. The shade of this is black. So this is a pencil eyeliner and like I said it lasts all day long and like it's great like this eyeliner is great like when you're going out to a party or any special event and you're like tired of getting like eyeliners that smudge and that comes off and you have to run to the bathroom to apply more eyeliner to your eyes. Mm -mm -mm. This doesn't do it at all this lasts all day long and i have tried this before in the morning and i left it on all day as well and i just really love this so much and i've been loving it so i'm really excited this year for 2017 to try out and explore different eyeliners okay so for highlighters so for highlighters I've been loving, so I'm going to go from the drugstore and then high end. So, the drugstore one I've been loving is Wet n Wild Mega Glow Multi Stick. So, this is Wet n Wild Mega Multi Stick. I've been loving this so much. It has like a pretty color. So, I'm going to swatch this. Look at this. Look how beautiful beautiful is this color it gives like a gray it's like um pink tones they have like a little bit uh, this is like light pink tone color and that's why i just really love this highlight so much and it's very affordable. i just really love it. and it's very convenient too it's great for traveling because it goes up now and you can stick it in your carry-on and you're good to go so the next um highlighter that I've been really loving for the year 2016 is Essence Pure Nude Highlighter. So this shade is Be My Highlight. This highlighter I've been loving for the longest. Oh my god, I've been using this one constantly as well and just really love it. The formula is great. Look at this. It's very light and it gives like, this is great for like an everyday use because it's very like natural looking. It's not that like, um, the color doesn't come out like very strong. It comes out like very neutral. So that's why I just really love it and it's great for everyday use. So if you don't want to get, if you don't want to have like, like pink or orange highlighters that are like very like very like super pigmented and you want something looking natural for everyday use when you're going to work going to school this is a great one and i've been loving this for 2016 and i just can't stop using this so i'm just gonna be honest with you when this goes out i'm gonna repurchase this okay so for high-end highlighters i've been loving Laura Tantalizer Highlighter and Matte Bronzer. So these are, this is our duo. So this has a highlighter and a bronzer. I've been loving these two so much. I've used both of them for the longest and I just really, really, really love it. This is very expensive. This costs $33, but I got this for Black Friday. I think I got it right. No, no, no. I'm lying right there. To be honest with you, I got this like months ago. It was like a certain sale. I don't know where I got it. I don't know. 
but it's a long time ago. I have mentioned this in my Ulta haul um, video. I've been a long time I got this, but I got this at Ulta Beauty for just $13. This costs $33. Lorac. Oh my god. The formula is great. Look at this. Look at this. And look at the bronzer. Look how beautiful. Oh, what's this? So that's why I just really love it. For lip liners, I have only one lip liner that I really love. I haven't found anything else that I really love because I don't normally wear a lip liner a lot. So the one that I really love is the Remno Running Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner. The shade is Enchantment. Okay, so this is a mauve color lip liner that I just really love. It's from Remnant Loving. I've been loving this lip liner for the longest. It's like the only one that I've been using. Like, I haven't tried any other lip liners in the market, but I heard that um, if you know any good lip liners, please let me know comment. Me comment below and help me out i'm looking and searching for lip liners like that's perfectly that doesn't smudge and it lasts all day long so if you know any good lip liners please let me know i need your help okay so i have only one liquid lipstick that i've been loving and has been using it constantly everyday use special occasion use it everywhere so the one that i've been using and i've been like obsessed with is ofra long lasting liquid lipstick la guana beach so this is the one that i have been loving this is ofra la guana beach this is a beautiful color i just really love it so much so i just swatched this Look how beautiful is this color. And it lasts all day long. I've been loving this color so much. Because it's like a neutral color. It's not too so dramatic. It's just perfect for everyday use. And also like special occasion too. So I like, that's why I said I use this everywhere. And it lasts all day long. All, all of the over long last looks they last all day long. Next for lipsticks, I have four lipsticks that I've been loving. I have two high-end lipsticks and I have two drugstore lipsticks. So I'm going to start with the drugstore one and I'm going to start with the high-end. So these lipsticks are going to be the ones that I've been crazy in love with for the year of 2016. So starting from the drugstore, I've been loving Revlon. 205 champagne on ice just real this is revlon champagne on ice i just really love it so much this is a beautiful color so i'm gonna swatch it and look how beautiful is this color oh my god it's really a champagne color and that's why i just really love this lipstick so much and I just can't stop using this. I use this like every day. You special okay. I just really love this Revlon champagne on ice. Okay, so the next drugstore lipstick that I've been loving is the Wet n Wild 918D Cherry Balm. So this is the Cherry Balm by Wet n Wild. I've been loving this lipstick so much because this has a, like a cranberry color to it. So I'm going to swatch this right now. Look at this. Oh my god. This is so beautiful, right? That's why I just really love this color so much. It has great cranberry color to it and it's great for the fall and winter now so that's why i just really love it so much it gets me like all cozy up because this color is beautiful it's a beautiful wine color and i just really love it so much like these are very affordable oh my god these are very affordable. I just really 
love it so much. Wet and Wild is definitely stepping up their game. And I can't wait to try new products from Wet and Wild this year. Okay, so next for like the high end products for um lipsticks is the Smashbox Be Legendary and Be Vivid Violet. This is the one that I've been loving. I've been using this constantly. It's a beautiful color. Let me see. I'm gonna swatch this right hand. This is the Viva Violet by Smashmont Be Legendary. I just love this lipstick so much. I use it constantly, like all the time. I just really love it so much. It's great and I love it and it's great like dramatic look to it. I just really love it so much. Really, 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 really love it. I have no other words to say about this part. Just really love it. Okay, the next high-end lipstick that I've been loving is MAC Peach Stock. This is MAC Peach Stock. It's like a neutral color. I've been loving this so much. It's like a neutral color. So I just swatched it right here on my knuckles. So this is a peach color. This lipstick, I love it. I use this every day. It's an everyday use. And I just really love this MAC peach stock it is a beautiful color and it's great for when you're going to work going to school it's great for an everyday use this is a setting spray that i've been loving for the longest for 2016 i use this all the time it is great 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 it really like locks in all your makeup throughout the day and i just really love it so much i really do it's not so watery, it lasts all day. You know? So if you guys are looking for like a drugstore, like um drugstore setting spray, this is great and just love it so much. And it's very affordable and it's oil free. So girl, if you have oily skin and you're looking for a setting spray that doesn't leave your face very shiny, I've been down that road. I've tried many setting sprays in the past that leaves my face like very shiny so this doesn't do it at all and that's why i just really love it this was a long video i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave to see new videos every tuesday and friday i'll see you in my next video